Hey guys, welcome to another video. I know it's been quite a while since I've done like a sit down video. I just recently started daily vlogging and I should have yesterday's video pretty soon. In fact, it's probably done exporting. Um, and it's just like a mom life daily vlogging type of videos. Anyway, today, if you haven't noticed by the title of this video, I, wow, I've said video like so many times now. Um, okay. I'm doing a what's in my diaper bag video and um, I guess I'm going to go between two books. I was going to, two books, two bags. I'm going to tell you which bag I was using and why I'm no longer using it and the new bag I am using and then all the stuff I have in my bag. And I literally, I swear to you guys, I have not gone through my bag. It's not even as organized as I would like it to be um, so I have no idea what we might find in there <laughs> I hope it's not too embarrassing or too crazy um, no I think I, I try to keep it organized as much as possible so you're not gonna find anything too crazy in there but anyway um, okay so bag I was using was a popular bag I think that um, a lot of people use it's the skip hop backpack and I think I found this at actually at Target randomly one night um, when I was nesting and <laughs> I found this and it was like 99 bucks on sale or $90 on sale or whatnot and um, yeah I was like yeah I need that I love it um, it has the little straps for the stroller and it's only backpack so I love this bag but the reason I stopped using it was because every time that I didn't have my girls with me and I was doing like a date night or going out with my girlfriends or just coffee with my girlfriends or whatever, um, I always found myself switching my bag. So I would take my stuff out of here that I needed and I would put it in. I have this really cute Kate Spade bag that I like. Um, so I usually switch it in there and it was just kind of getting annoying. And that's one of the reasons. The main reason though why I really stopped using this bag was, well, um, you know, it's only a backpack and I could never really put it over my shoulder or um, even, you know, like an entire body bag thing. It was always on my back and then this handle. So, you know, obviously that doesn't look good if you're walking around like so. Um, but really what I was trying to get at was that I don't know if you guys can see, and I don't know if this is the case with everybody who has this backpack, but specifically with myself, it might be because of the length of my torso. I'm pretty tall, um, so maybe it happens to just tall chicks. I don't know, but basically, it's not these adjustable gold straps, but I don't know if you can see. It's these gold little rectangle rectangles here. Uh, what they do is when I wear them, they literally dig in to like, bottom that's where they rest they rest right at the bottom of my ribs like right at the end of them excuse me and um, they just really started to like just irritate those uh, the sides there under my ribs it would just kind of rub against it with like every time I walked anytime I did it every time I was wearing it and I moved it was just kind of rubbing on there and then it started to kind of get red and irritated and it was just hurting so I stopped using it as a backpack and I really no longer used it because I couldn't do this thing and I was swapping or whatever so um, if you're shorter I don't know I mean let me know if you guys have the same problem but overall the bag is super cute I keep it now because I I basically this is a bag I give to like my mother-in-law for example if she takes the girls to the zoo or just like an extra bag for doing things. Um, this is the bag I would use or give to her when she goes on trips with the girls. And um, yeah, it's it's pretty cool. I, I mean, I like it, it's just not like ideal for me. But the new bag that I have now, which I absolutely love, 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 is this, um, it's called Coco and Kiwi Bag. It's so cute. And it's uh, like navy blue. Or is it black? I don't know. It's, sometimes it's hard to tell. I'm actually really good at my colors. I'm pretty sure it's black and white. And yeah, it's definitely black. And um, this is faux leather, which is good for vegans if you care about that at all. And the cocoa and kiwi is kind of like in this, in this gold thing. 
But this thing is amazing. Let me tell you why. Okay, first of all, it's big enough. It carries all of your stuff. It has so many pockets and zippers, um, things that you wouldn't think that you really needed. And on top of that, oh, I have a hair now. Nice. <laughs> um, okay, but on top of that, uh, you can wear it three ways. Not only does it have the sh fancy shoulder strap things that we love so much, but you can also hold it shoulder strap and it's pretty long. And you can also hold it body bag, right? Like so. And the coolest part is, let me take off the shoulder strap. You can also use it as a backpack. Let me show you how you do that. So, the back of the bag has this gold bar, this thing here, and this thing here. And you grab your little guy, and you basically, I know you guys probably can't see this, but I'm just gonna do it real fast. You clip it, you put it through this bar, like so, and then you clip it to the other end, and you know, obviously your stuff is zipped up and it is now, flip it over this way, it is now a backpack. So, and of course you can make this tighter or looser. I would make, I would never wear it as a backpack, so that might be why, but it's, um, if I loosened it up, it's a backpack and it's just really cute. So, you know, like if you really have your hands full, then you can just put it like this. Um, and it's really comfortable. And it doesn't, those darn clips don't dig into my back. I'm fearful of that now. It just makes me nervous. I've never had a problem with backpacks before until then. But this is really comfortable. I, obviously, I need to loosen it up a little bit, but um, it's still comfortable. And yeah, and I found this guy on um, Instagram. I follow them, Coco and Kiwi. CO CO and um, they have tons and tons of cute bags. They have reversible ones or whatever, but I got this one on sale, I think for $80. So it cost me less than that guy. I think normal price is probably like, probably what the regular price of this bag is. I, don't, I honestly can't even tell you it. I wanna say it's like between 100 and 120. It's not like super crazy, but I love it because this is so versatile. So. I guess now it's time to get into the bag. Okay, so you have your side pockets here, side pocket here. I don't, am I doing like a bag review? No, I'm doing a what's in my bag. Okay, so the super cute part about this bag is that the interior is just, you know, easy to wipe vinyl material and it's green, a favorite color, and it just complements the brown and the black and the white so well. Um, and the whole interior is like that as well. So, I guess let's get into what is in here. Oh my god, I don't even know where to start. I guess let's start on the sides here. Okay. Okay, on this side pocket here. I have an old baby wipe, not dirty with pooper pee, but with makeup. So, yeah. That's, that's an awesome way to start. Then, after that, on the other side of this bag, oh yeah, I forgot I had this in there. I have, oh, I can't even get in here. Let's see, I have a quarter. I have this um, hospital hand sanitizer which I should probably toss this. This is when I had to go to the hospital um, a while back ago, like a while back. Um, oh, oh, this stuff is awesome, yeah. Um, this is Kroger brand, you know, just like your generic brand. It's baby and kids sunscreen stick. So instead of carrying like a big old bottle um, and have it accidentally get everywhere, I use this stuff, which I love. Hopefully it's focusing, you guys. I don't know, Ooh, I'm nervous. Um, but yeah, I use this, looks like so, and I literally, I usually rub it on their face, and um, this looks like a new one, this must have, might be my new one, but yeah, 
It's nice. It's good to have. We live in Arizona and today, actually today's not that hot. It's only like 105. So, um, yeah, that stuff. And then what else do I have in here? Oh, I found something. Oh, a dime. Okay, I should probably be putting, this is a good opportunity to even clean out my purse, guys. I like this video. Okay, this back zipper here. I have, I have, oh, this is where it gets bad. Oh yeah, I need to take care of this. This is um, an iFly indoor skydiving ticket. We have a voucher for like 10, 10 more, 10 more times. So yeah, I need to take care of this. This is from when my husband and I went. By the way, you guys, if you haven't gone indoor skydiving, it's super, super fun. It's a great date thing to do. My husband and I, one of the things we did on our anniversary. Okay, I have facial, like, you know, tissue. I'm literally reading it, facial tissue. I have tissues um, and a lighter. <laughs> Probably for candles, because I love candles and a toothpick that I just dropped and I need to pick up because it's not safe with the kids. So yeah, putting that stuff back in there. That's all I have in there. Okay, so the inside is pretty cool. Um, there's several areas. So you have an inside zipper that's on the opposite, the inside zipper that's on the opposite of that. On the inside, you also have pockets like so on each end. And then this side, you have this black flap that you can unzip and it has a zipper itself. And this is what I call, oh look, I, I have floss. I should probably move that to my lighter side here. Um, so this I use as like a wet bag. And I have a wet bag too, I don't even know if it's in here, but I have another wet bag that I got from like baby, Bye Bye Baby, I think that's what it's called. Um, but like if you have a wet diaper and you don't have a trash bag, you put it in here. If you like took your kids to the splash pad and you need to like, you know, put their bathing suit somewhere and you change them, you rinse, you know, you squeeze out the excess water and you put it in here. And um, yeah, it's just kind of like a cool little thing that they have. And you can, like I said, you can zip it on there and zip it off. When it's zipped off, um, you have this extra big old, um, like, oh, you guys probably can't see. You guys have this big old, like, thing here with this massive pocket. See, and this is where that thing zips onto. So if it's zipped on, you literally just flip it out. So let me just really quickly zip it. So when I need to get to that other pocket, and that's where the diaper changing pad is in. So I usually flip that out. And then in here, I have the pad. Is that my phone? My phone's ringing. Anyways, diaper pad. Um, what else do I have in that big old slot? Oh, what is this thing called again? It's like a, it's a splint for my thumb because on Mother's Day I stabbed it really bad and it's, I really need to go to the doctor for it to be honest because it still hasn't healed. And it pops and I can't bend it more than that. Yeah, so um, okay. On the opposite side, let me tuck that back in there. On the opposite side where I have the zipper, but on the inside, let's look. Okay, there's this little bandana. It's for my kids. What is this called? Not a bandana, a headband. Um Okay, so I have a breast pad, because you never know. I'm nursing my baby. Um, oh, I have this Bare Minerals lip liner. I love it, it's my freaking favorite. Actually, I'm wearing it right now. It's called Gen Nude, which is general nude. Fits anybody, I totally agree. I love it, love it, love it, love it. Um, I also have this one, Lavender Organic Hand Sanitizer. It's that Dr. Bronner stuff. I got it at Sprouts. Anyways, I really like it, but here's the thing. It smells amazing, but it kind of feels sticky. So I only, I don't really use hand sanitizer a lot. This is kind of like in case of emergencies thing, kind of hand sanitizer. Um, okay, I have Carmex. It's 
cherry. I have um, all this stuff too. Normally I wear this over this, like if I'm going out, like if, yeah, if I end up going out that night or, which I don't because I'm a mom. <laughs> but um, on the rare occasion that I do, this is what I put on and um, I love it. Probably gonna have it off weird. Yeah, anyways, I like it. It kind of goes with that. Um, let's see. I have this pen, which my husband got me a long time ago. It's a cross pen, just super fancy, y'all. And it like writes beautifully and you just get refills for it. Um, I did not know that you can spend a lot of money on pens, but apparently it's a thing, it's a thing. Um, I have Eucerin Baby Eczema Relief. Why do I have that in there? Oh. Must have been like a bundle thing. I don't know, probably like a newborn pack I got. Um, lotion. I do use this lotion though. I didn't know I had this in there. Um, my kids don't have eczema, at least not that I know of. So, let's see. Oh, I have a yellow pebble that Nova loves to collect rocks. And she gives them to me and I save them all. My husband kind of finds it annoying. He's like, okay, Janine, after a while you think you'd be like, okay, it's just a rock. But, I don't know. I save them. Hair tie. I really hope that you guys that you guys can see me. Okay, I'm just gonna get everything. Um, a spoolie. Is that what it's called? I think that's what it's called. For my eyelashes, when I get my eyelashes um, done, when I get the extensions, this is a guy I use. I really shouldn't leave it in there, but I do. Um, baby nail clippers, because you never know. Um, and 75, 85 cents. So I'm gonna say one more change somewhere. Where is it? I actually have a coin for somewhere in here. Okay, and then they have these two. Let's do the side slots that are in the inside, opposite of these side ones. So on one side, I literally have nothing. On the other, I have my glasses case, which my glasses are actually by my laptop over there. Um, nothing too great. And then you have your two slots like this. And this is where I have my diapers. So on one slot, I have my youngest diapers, and these are the Honest Diapers size two for Lyra. And yeah, I really like these. At first, um, I, I didn't use Honest Diapers with her until size two. Before that, I used um, like Baby Organics or something like that because I felt like they, they were really good at holding in the, you know, explosion so um, now she's on to the honest diapers I really need to put the stuff back do I have anything else in there a sock a baby sock I really like this because really I'm getting to clean out my thing okay um, in the other slot I have my two-year-olds diapers honest diapers as well um, these are really cute but yeah I only have one in there for her because we just went to the library and yeah, that was that was pretty interesting. Okay, then you have your main slot, which is where all the good stuff is. Okay, I have um, a onesie in case of a blowout. That's the word, a blowout. I was thinking like exposed, yeah, blowout. Um, sweet as mommy. I don't know where we got this. Probably just a gift from someone, but zero to three months. Um, water wipes. I have one. I have two. And I think that might be it. Um, seriously, the best. I've been using water wipes for so long. Um, I absolutely love them. Chemical free, 99.9% .9 water, 0.1% fruit extract. My girls never have any problems with these. I've tried other wipes with my first when she was born. Um, I tried to make my own. That got a little tedious. And then I found the next best thing. So... I just get like a shipment from Amazon that automatically ships once a month. You get a big box, it cost me like 23 bucks. I could be wrong, but it's somewhere around there. But anyways, water wipes. Um, my wallet, which I'm I'm such in need of getting a new wallet. This is a Kate Spade wallet, and I could sit here and go through everything in my wallet, but really it's just a bunch of craziness. And Probably not very interesting. 
Um, but my little latch thing broke. And it was really cute, but now it's really dirty. So, stuff, stuff, you know, just stuff. You should see this thing. Sometimes it gets crazy with receipts. Um, next, I have Happy Public Library. Like I said, we went to the library today. I should probably save that so I remember the date. August 3rd. I need to return those books. Okay, next I have another receipt. Bad. Um, fries. Bam. Okay, next I have coupons. <laughs> this is bad. Um, I just kind of grab these. I never look at them. I just throw them away. For some reason my camera like came out. So anyways, um, the Dolce & Gabbana. Um, I got these when I thought I was going into labor. My husband, um, he bought me glasses and then they were like um, Burberry or something like that. Bur Burberry, 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 I don't know. Um, I'm not like a big brand person, but um, he got me those, which I absolutely loved, but my, I have like a small head kind of. <laughs> so they, every time like I moved my head, like the sunglasses would fall and they were just really loose. And so I went back and I tried to get them tight end and we couldn't get them tight end. So anyways, my husband and I went back together and I ended up picking these guys out, which I actually really love. They're similar style to the ones he got me anyway. They're just a different brand, but they're really cute. They have this like, rose kind of thing inside so they're dirty I need to clean them. uh okay so let me put those back it's going to go messy here I have so much to do here guys okay then I have library I go to the library a lot I love books I try to read at least one book a week so you know just the call numbers for books I also have a bib because you know she drools Baby drool, they just do. Um, I have a burp cloth. This is like the muslin one. I don't know. Actually, never ever ever use this. It just sits in there, just in case. I always have to be prepared, I guess. Oh jeez. Okay, I have paper towel in here. Not supposed to be like this, but I have my Invisalign wrapped up in there. That's dangerous. If you have Invisalign, don't ever do that. They even tell you don't do that because you accidentally throw it away. Um, and there's my case. Look at that. Should be, you know what? Well, I'm already at it. I should just be doing that now. I, these are last week, so really I don't even need to put them in, but yeah. I guess why not? Okay, now that could be trash. Um, okay, I have a wrapper for uh, breast pads, another receipt to Greek pita. My husband and I love Greek food and we love Indian food. It's like our favorite. You'd think I would like Mexican food because I'm Mexican, but I ate it all of my life. Another coupon. Oh, a Tesla card. My husband and I have been looking at the new Tesla, I don't know what it is, Model X, because it has three rows. And I really like it, so we're just debating whether we want electric or gas. So anyways, we recently went to go, they now sell them in Arizona, so we're looking at that. I'm gonna hold on to that, because we actually need that guy's name. Um, wrapper, breast pad, Jesus. Another breast pad. A mint. Um, what is this? A stegosaurus thing. don't know where that came from. Um, Eucerin hand relief, advanced repair, um, repairs, very, yeah, here, lotion. Um, I don't use this, but I have it in here because, tell me how awesome I am, my husband. I have it just in case for my husband if we're somewhere, and um, he just feels like he has dry hands, which sometimes he does. He does this all day. So, um, <laughs> yeah, that's for him. This is not just a baby bag, this is a husband bag too. Um, what else? Oh, I have this clip, which I should, no, it's, yeah, it's kind of bad. It's kind of old. I got this at DSW Shoes, but it's like a velvety maroon hair clip. And I really like it. Um, I have another mint. 
I have a library pencil. I told you I, I, I go a lot. Um, I'm trying to like, yeah, I'm almost done. A coin purse. My sister gave this to me years ago before I even had kids and all I put are silver coins in here. Literally. Wow, that's cool. You never know. This is pretty much the stash for my kids when they want, you know, those little like machine things and they want the toys. I think that's where that Stegosaurus thing came from, I swear, from the car wash. I think, yeah, that's where it came from. Um, so yeah, that's like carousels and car rides and that stash. Um, uh, this was a baby bow, but it looks like it's his broken now. Let's see, it's very easy to fix. Ta-da! Baby bow. I think that's how it goes. Yeah, like so. It's a baby bow. Um, I also have another sock. <laughs> I have a Cat and Jack tag. Something else, some trash. I love Cat and Jack, by the way, from Target. They have some really cute stuff. Um, Old Navy tag, baby stuff. Um, something for something. Oh, gift card thing. Somebody gave me a gift card. So, information for that because it's very important stuff. Um, then I have deodorant, secret, my little mini to go one. Um, I never really use it. I use like a lavender one upstairs, um, but just in case. Always have to try to be prepared. And last but not least, I have a booger sucker. So, yeah. And guys, that concludes my what's in my diaper bag video. I can't believe I just did this. <laughs> but it's nice because now when I put all this stuff back, I can organize it. And if you guys really like this bag, I will put the links down, the link down below for this bag. Like I said, it's super awesome. It's super easy to clean. It's just all out like the best. They also have like a different color scheme if you're not a big fan of this style, I don't know. Oh, and then it has these little metal things on the bottom of this. Like if you sit it down, it doesn't get the bottom of the bag so dirty. And yeah, I just love it so much. Anyways, yeah, that's my what's in my mama bag, my husband bag video. So I hope that you guys enjoyed watching this video. I didn't realize how messy my bag was, so it's kind of nice that I did this because like I said, I can organize it now and I will stop rambling and I will see you all in my next one. Oh, and comment down below if you would like to and give this video a like if you liked it, obviously, and subscribe if you haven't already. And I think we're all set. Have a nice day, guys. Bye.